my channel, Let's Talk About It Media 21. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and please hit the notification bell. That way, every time I upload a video, you will be the first one to see it. So, all comments are alleged, in our opinion, and for entertainment purposes only, where we discuss celebrity news, celebrity gossip, what's going on on IG and Google. Fair use. Copyright disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act 1976. Fair use is used only to buy a copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. All comments are alleged, in our opinion, and for entertainment purposes only. Don't forget the best way to support the channel is to like, make comments, and subscribe. And also hit the notification bell that way every time I upload a video, you will be the first one to see it. So let's talk about it. About eight or nine months ago, maybe six, maybe six or seven months ago, I did a video, Is There Concerns with Cynthia Bailey and Mike? Because as you know, she was on the girls trip, housewives, girls trip, whatever that is called. And many of the wives or girlfriends were speaking to their boyfriend or significant other. It didn't seem like Cynthia and Mike were connecting. It seems like she was traveling a lot and she wasn't really traveling with him because, of course, he would have been a part of the pictures. So I did videos and, of course, a few days later, they someone will post that it seems like they were still together. But everyone knew. And in regards to his interview, he did the interview saying he wasn't certain if they were going to make it to year two or three, whatever. So it's sad that they're not together. It's basically saying Cynthia Bailey denies infidelity was the factor in her divorce with Mike Hill. This is not a this is not a tragic ending. But many people knew that he was really, really close to many women being friends with them. And many people can have friends of the opposite sex and be close to them but it just seems like a lot of them had maybe had relations with him prior to Cynthia so that's interesting when you're out of town he's hanging out with all these other women so of course he can get a kind of feeling a certain kind of way but then as of course everything that was happening in regards to the world then they became closer and they start living within the same city because everyone was on you know the lockdown <laughs> and everybody was in the homes and they were closer to their families more so than normal so well wishes but let's let's talk about what's being said today so peter thomas enters the building cynthia bailey ex-husband peter thomas weighs in on the relationship split with mike hill says she's a queen who deserves the best but the biggest thing is we've seen what happened in regards to cynthia and peter We've seen that Cynthia allegedly had to sue him, allegedly, for, I don't know if it was restaurant stuff, we don't know, but they were kind of going back and forth, and I do believe they were stating Peter didn't really take anything. He basically gave Cynthia everything, and then remember how their relationship started. They got married into a museum, the mom really didn't care for Peter, and then they were going back and forth. Her relationship with Peter lasted longer than the other relationship. I don't think she ever married the baby father of her daughter, but yeah, her relationship with Peter, they, there wasn't a lot of media press. It would be something every now and then, but we've seen on TV how their relationship started. She was emotional at the beginning of before they got married, then they got married and there was concerns and then Peter was having concerns about restaurants, but his restaurants are doing great now. But in regards to we see because it's on TV, what the relationship is, and kind of why it ended. So what well wishes to Cynthia? Because it's not easy. You know, she is getting older. It would have been great if her and Mike could have lasted. And then that was the other thing. Everyone was talking about the timeline in regards to when Cynthia and Mike really met. People were saying there was an interview with them together prior to them being on the Steve Harvey show and then they made it seem like Steve brought them together. No, I think they had met prior to, but here nor there. She's divorced from Peter. She's divorced from Mike. Who will she date next? Will she come back on The Real Wild Housewives of Atlanta? Did she leave knowing she didn't want to talk about Mike? Who knows? And will Portia come back? Oh, people are hoping not because there's just too many altercations. And then to take somebody else's husband, and people can say, can you take somebody else's husband? Yes. If you're presenting yourself that you want to be with, you can take somebody else's husband. You're giving him the attention that the wife probably don't know what's going on. If you gave the number, and then you're meeting up, and your conversation, 
things can happen between a couple that shouldn't be happening. So what wishes? How you get them is how you're going to lose them. It may not be right now with Portia, but at some point in time, who knows? But trust me, she's always giving him the side eye because how she met him is how, you know, he started cheating on his wife. But Will she have a wedding? Will people tune in? We don't know. But that's in regards to that. So let's talk about Black China is serving face. I think she's basically talking about her eyelash wear. And many people are really excited for Black China. She's doing it. She's, you know, she's selling products. This is not a paid promotion. This is not a paid ad. We're just seeing how people can rise above after the K's and the J's. Um, and I believe this other one is in regards to her showing her closet since this is not a paid ad I'm not going to promote anything, but she's showing different items and then this one is talking about uh, her Her closet. So well wishes to black China, you know, she's doing things. I can't play the music, but she's selling different items She's trying to put herself out there. Of course, we don't know what has transpired about the lawsuit with the K's and the J's. We'll see what happens in regards to the appeal.